Hey guys, it's Amber. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the final part. Hopefully, praying to Jesus that this is the final part of Let's Play The Sims 3 A to Z Baby Challenge. So it is Snowflake Day. Um, I just did a little bit off camera. Basically, um, Sebastian aged up and I had him move out because I wanted to make sure that the game registered it's okay for her to have twins. Not that we've ever had a problem with it before. However, I know this game. I know how temperamental this game can be. And I know how sometimes this game wants me to suffer. So how, what better way for me to suffer than for her to only have one baby? But that's not going to happen. We're gonna have twins, maybe even triplets. I refuse to accept anything else. I will quit and I will start again. Like, I refuse, but, um, anyways, so it is Snowflake Day, so these guys are gonna be hanging out at home or doing whatever it is they wanna do, and I am going to be entirely focused on May and trying to get her to have triplets. So this part is probably going to be a little bit shorter, um, because we wanna make sure, or because it's the last day of her pregnancy, she's gonna give birth later on today, and... Um, the only other thing that I can think of to have them do is to have her listen to music and watch TV. So let me turn the radio on, make sure that it's on so that she can get it while she's in here, um, making her food. But yeah, this part's going to be pretty short because we don't have to do anything else this part. This entire part is devoted to, you know, having her give birth. That's the entire point of this, uh, this part. So we don't have to work on anything else. We don't have to age anyone else up. We don't got to work on anybody's skills. It's solely about having her give birth to triplets or twins. I would prefer twins. <laughs> Although triplets, uh, is probably a safer bet. We'll just have an extra one and I'll have to figure out how to go about doing that. I can't believe that this is the end of this, which means that a new Let's Play Xavier reached Elder status. Different Xavier, I guess. I was like, hello? <laughs> um, so basically, the new Let's Play starts next week. Uh, for those of you that haven't guessed it, it is an all-in-one Let's Play. Um, there's, It's gonna be story-based. Uh, it's gonna be sort of a choose-your-own-style gameplay. Sort of like if you ever watched my Sims 4 Let's Play, it's gonna be like that. Um, but I'm really, really excited to start it. Uh, so excited, okay. Girl, your belly big, but my hopes are bigger. Okay, I need you to have multiples. It's important. Can you go and make your mom's bed for her? Thank you. Then you can go and pay the bills for me because you can be a nice child. And really, I don't really care what else they do throughout the day. I just need like... I just need like to focus on this. It seems to be going well. Um, maybe we'll go, maybe we'll give her a break and go and get her a massage. I feel like she might like that. Go and get a massage, maybe just a quick one. Have her be happy. You know, she's probably never gotten a massage before in her whole life. And like, you know, she's, this is her final pregnancy. Although I guess potentially if she wanted to, she could have more babies because she's got eight days before she ages up. But this is her last pregnancy at least for this challenge and I feel like she deserves it you know she's gonna have 26 children possibly 27 children I feel like if you have that many babies you definitely deserve a massage okay you definitely deserve a massage how far what is going on with this day spa oh it's like in the middle of a plaza how cute is that okay Go ahead and go in there. We didn't even have to pay full price because apparently we're a celebrity. We're a one-star celebrity. All right, we're gonna head on home. We're gonna hope and pray for the best. We're gonna try and get her needs up a little bit before she has the baby. Although she's probably gonna go into labor anytime um, because it's getting near 
there's no way this part's gonna be that short. 10 minutes? It's probably gonna be 10 minutes. That's okay. Um, let's go ahead and take a shower. And then use the bathroom. I, and then I guess... Uh, oh, just kidding. We're not going to be able to do any of that because we're going to the hospital. All right, let's go. This is it. I'm going to I'm going to go. <laughs> I'm going to go on speed one just to make me and you both annoyed. Oh, God, <laughs> the tension is building. We are on our way to the hospital to have the final babies of this challenge. If she doesn't have twins. I'm silent because I just, I don't have the amount of words to contain that rage <laughs> that I would have. <laughs> I would be so mad. Oh my God. Okay. Please. I will literally cheat twins. I will go to create a sim and create a duplicate. <laughs> We've never had a single baby before. And now is not the time. It is not the time for that. We need twins. Twins, 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 twins. Everybody shout with me. Twins, 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 twins. First is Y names. Nobody left any baby name suggestions, but you know what? I feel like that's kind of fitting, like me getting to figure out what I want to name the last two babies. Y is always hard, though. Y is always hard. Okay, it's a girl. Uh, she's got the genius trait. Let's go with Yuna. Just because she is a K-pop star that I know, Yuna. <laughs> okay, cross your fingers, please. <laughs> Yay! It's the end! Okay, we had another girl! Wow! Okay, we're gonna go with, um, shout out to one of my real life best friends. We're gonna name her, hello? Or I can't type today, and my keyboard is broken again at the last final minute that we need it. Uh, we're gonna name her Zarya. She's brave and evil. Triplets? Okay, we have a spare baby. Um, and it's another girl. We had triplet girls. That's never happened. Uh, I don't. If it was a boy, I was gonna name him Juan, like this, like 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 one, because like you know when you get done with the alphabet, you go on to numbers. So um, maybe I'll name her Wanda, which sounds stupid. Hello. I'm thinking I'm going to name her Wanda, like Wanda, because she's our sp spare baby, baby Wanda. Heavy sleeper and eccentric. Triplet girls, huh? <gasps> That's a thing. It's Turby. No, that's Turby too. Artistic and perceptive. If she has five. <laughs> Yowza! Marvin Rivers and for Marvin Rivers Ferrari and May Hearth have their work cut out to them with the addition of four. Oh yes, we said four new babies oh my god i thought maybe she would have twins maybe triplets 
but May Hearth has done the impossible. She didn't have 25 babies. She didn't have five babies. She didn't have 10 babies. She didn't have 20 babies. She didn't have 25 babies, 26 babies. This girl had 28 babies. Her last pregnancy, not a set of twins, not a set of triplets, quadruplets. Yuna, Zarya, Wanda, and Toby Hearth. Can you even believe that? I'm gonna have to buy an extra crib. I'm not even playing past this point. But I'm gonna have to buy an extra crib. Oh my god! <laughs> the just inner turmoil on my- like, in my body when that happened. I just <laughs> oh my god! Unexpected ending! Wow! Alrighty, well, um, I guess it would only be fair. Why don't we go ahead and just age them all up? Because I want to see what they all look like, and I, I feel like that Good would be so. fun. All right, young adult Uriel we go. is just as much of a nerd as teenage Uriel, but he's so cute. All right, Brunard. Uriel is aged up. Next, Tessa. You're going to have to get up, girl. Okay, Tessa, go here. We're going to age you up. Master controller, advanced. Edit and create a sim. I just had a whole heart attack. David. A whole heart attack, you guys. We're gonna go make sure she's in her everyday wear. A whole heart attack. Chabadu. Tessa. Batibusa? Still got some weird looking eyebrows. But she's really cute. She looks just like her mom. Oh, wow. Okay. Next. Xavier. These ones are going to be fun because these ones are uh, the ones where they're children or even babies aging up to adults. All right. What do you look like as a young adult, bro? So, so. Okay, I think he looks like his dad. All right. That's Xavier. Nice hat. <laughs> I don't think my heart will ever recover from when I saw the fourth baby. Okay, who's next? Wyatt. <laughs> Wyatt. Young adult Wyatt. Let's see. Sashko. Okay, he's... I think him and uh, Xavier are identical twins because these guys look exactly alike. Nice bandana, though. It seems like both of them are fans Bar of dunes. head accessories. Bandanas and hats. Okay. Vanessa. Here you go. Um, Just thinking back, my favorite child, I really liked <laughs> Brett. I really liked Brett. He was one of the OGs that I almost forgot existed because we've been playing this for so long. Okay, Vanessa. Dang, girl, you look just like your brothers. Nice nose, um, nice shirt. This is an interesting fashion outfit, but like, good on you that you like aren't afraid to experiment. You know what I mean? My least favorite child. Who was that one that like never wanted to age up in the mid? It was like M or something. All right. Hey guys. Um, this is an afterthought. That's why it's The Sims 4 and not The Sims 3, because The Sims 3 takes forever to uh, go up. I was going to age up the babies, and I ended up deciding against it, which was good, because the game ended up crashing, um, which means it didn't save any of that. But you know what? I don't care, because I have it on video, and I'm not going to let that escape me. That whole reaction, it was so genuine. And so I really, I just wanted to come back in and say thank you guys so much for joining with me, coming with me on this adventure of a series. And I hope you guys decide to, uh, you know, turn in, tune in, not turn in, tune in to my new all-in-one Let's Play that starts next 
Friday. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this series. I certainly did. And wow, was that a twist ending. Um, but yeah, I will uh, see you guys in my next video. Uh, I love you all so much. And thank you for being here with me this whole time. Bye, everyone.